As the parents of Matthew Shepard laid their son to rest today, his father called it a sense of relief. It's so important that we now have a home for Matt, a home that others can visit, a home that is safe from haters. Shepard died after being beaten and tied to a fence in Wyoming by two men who targeted Shepard because he was gay. Shepard became a symbol of the gay rights movement after his death, and now his ashes will be interred at the Washington National Cathedral. The Shepherds waited for so long to, to bury Matthew's ashes because they were fearful that some anti-gay individual or group would find his grave and, and desecrate it somehow. Gene Robinson helped lead today's service. Robinson was the first openly gay bishop in the Episcopal Church, and today he carried Shepherd's ashes into the cathedral. And because he's become such a symbol for us, it feels like an indescribable honor to bring him into church. The National Cathedral gave Shepherd the unique honor of being laid to rest here, along with President Woodrow Wilson and Helen Keller. You are safe now. Oh yeah, and Matt, welcome home. For The Now, I'm Corey Rangel.